We're on this camera. I know, right? <laughs> it's eight, things up on it's eight forty-six, <laughs> and we have a crew in the studio with us. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Yeah, we're very excited because we're talking hockey already. Yeah. It's like finally starting to get cooler. It's starting so to get cool. All the grocery this. stores now have their fall yes. food on display, <laughs> yeah. and that means goals are back. So uh, good morning to the goals girls, to Gulliver, and to Matt Savant. Thank you for being Hi. with us this Thank morning. Thank you for having us. So yeah. I mean, a lot of uh, excitement building. We know San Diego really rallies behind the goals. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. San Diego has been uh, just a, a great spot for hockey. And, yeah. um, you know, we've actually had hockey here in San Diego since 1966. Right. And so the goals have been here a long time. So mm -hmm. our fans are really passionate and really connected. And today we wanted to talk a little bit about what's going on this season. Yeah. I love so, it. so wait, first of all, when does the season start? What's our big day? So our home opener <laughs> is Friday, October 21st. Okay. And every year we have a huge crowd for our home opener. Right. We're expecting the same. So we want to let people know that everyone in attendance We'll get this rally there towel. I love that. And when, yes. the, when the guys come out, we want everyone don't going crazy with those <laughs> rally exactly. towels. Exactly. We're also going to have a light up bracelet. I love those. Yep. Okay. And those, so that flashes too, right? You correct. can change that. Yep. Exactly. That's cool. Those are really fun because they do last a while. They so do. even beyond the game, right. <laughs> you get to like light up wherever you want to go. They'll be blinking in your room. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Yes. Take it yeah. out. As yeah. you should. Yeah. yeah. But so the rally towels are really good ones. First, it says 22 on it. So yeah. we want to like commemorate They're this special. season, this right. year. Yeah. Yeah, we're ready. So that night we're gonna do a laser show with okay. the bracelets. Uh, we're gonna have a DJ in the crowd. Wait, wow! Laser show I know. Inside, inside oh. with the bracelets <laughs> and the rally towels. It's gonna be a lot of fun. A DJ in the crowd. A DJ in the crowd. You yes. guys are also partnering with a lot of nonprofits. Correct. You know, getting uh, the word out about different organizations. Right? Absolutely. We do a lot of charity work in mm -hmm. the community, and now that we're pushing through COVID, our players are able to come back into the community. Mm -hmm. Our right. coaches, and we're able to go to the hospitals, go to the yeah. schools, teach street hockey to kids. So uh, our philanthropic efforts are. Are really a big part of what we are. Right. And Gulliver, we know, likes to get around. Yes. yes. <laughs> Gulliver, we, we're outside because there's a little drizzle out there, but when Gulliver came in, slicking his hair back, right. exactly, making sure we he looks handsome. We didn't want to see the brothers <laughs> get all wet, so that's why we're inside. Right. I love it. Literally, Gulliver's like the best mascot. Yeah, I'm right? not kidding. I, I mean, completely so agree. Always running action. around the jungle, <laughs> along with the girls, of course. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really good at what you do. Uh, so, yes, of course, and then what's the other one? We got another giveaway. So, that's a good one. Yeah, so in general, we have mm. six uh, giveaways okay. all year. So this is just a couple of them. But um, on November 5th, we're going to do a Mexican Heritage Night. That's nice. So yeah. obviously, Mexican Heritage is very close to the city of San Diego. Mm -hmm. So we wanted to make sure that we honored that. And so we're putting a whole night together. We're working with the Mexican consulate to make sure that we're doing everything correctly. And we're going to put on a really great night. Perfect. That hat is an example. Yeah. And that's themed after the Mexican flag. And we're going to give those away to those people that buy certain ticket packages. Okay. And if you just love the hat, you can buy it at retail when you get to the game. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Yeah. So it'll be there at the arena. It'll too. be there. Okay. Plus, uh, t-shirts and beanies and all kinds of yeah. other merchandise. So That's yeah. That's great. I, we have such a cross-border region. Correct. So many of us live and work and come in back and forth into U.S. and Mexico. So it's nice to represent. It's the first time we've really paid homage to that, and yeah. it's something that I think is really important to our community. Okay. It yeah. looks like it. on your guys' website, single tickets are going to be on sale soon, right? But the group tickets and the like memberships are what you're going for right you now. You right? are correct, and thank you very much. So we're trying to sell our season ticket uh, packages. That's the best deal in the building right. basically mm -hmm. you get uh, you get discounted uh, items you get discounted tickets free parking so there's a lot of benefits to be a season ticket holder but if you're interested in some of these nights you can actually buy tickets right now on okay. our website for certain games so uh, there's a there's a lot of really fun ideas we have this year and this is just a couple of them and you know we can keep talking about them but it's good to book them up now yeah right? exactly do it now, now and then you got it set right. this we, looks really cozy can I just go absolutely <laughs> you wrap me in a nice blanket <laughs> it's a little chilly out there today thank you ladies <laughs> <laughs> the Goals girls are very sweet. I love this. Uh, but let's see what it says on there. America's finest city. What do those years represent? So this is what's called our third jersey. So every team okay. has a home and an away, and you have the opportunity to do a third jersey. So oh, cool. last year we launched our third jersey, which is kind of a promotional jersey. There's three dates there, 1944, mm -hmm. 1966, and, and 2015. Those are the three years that the San Diego Goals either established or came back to the city. Oh, wow. So over the years, we've been part of this community for a long time. Yeah. The name and the logo have really been part of San Diego for a long time. So we wanted to pay homage to that. And of course, we play and live in America's finest city. Aren't mm -hmm. we all so lucky? Yes, yes. Uh, so we're going to do a giveaway. It's a Winter Wonderland themed event on uh, Saturday, 
uh, December 17th, and we're going to give everyone that comes to that game that blanket. Wow. You, That's a you got to stay cozy, That's right? That's a big yeah. blanket. It's cold in there. Yeah. And then also, we have a fun thing called the teddy bear toss. I don't know if you yeah. guys have seen yes. this. Yes. But as soon as the goals score their first <laughs> goal on Saturday, December 17th, we are going to ask all of our fans to bring a teddy bear, throw it onto the ice. This oh, is wow. when we encourage you throwing something on the yes. ice. <laughs> and all those bears will be scooped up by our players, and then we're going to donate them to Rady's Children's Hospital. That's we so love sweet. showing that on the air. Yeah. Whenever mm -hmm. it happens, it's always a big scene, and we want this to be like the biggest in the San biggest. Diego, right? right? We want to see everyone with teddy bears throwing right. those. And that's after the first goal, but then you have to clear it really quick because well, they got to <laughs> keep on playing. We put our players to work. They that's get right. the shovels out, and they, they get those bears in big bins, and we donate them the next day. That yeah. is really sweet. Yeah. You do a lot of great work for our local hospitals, for kids. I mean, it's really important. Tell us about that. I mean, why is that such a big deal yeah, for the goals? It actually starts with our ownership. So mm -hmm. our ownership, um, Henry and Susan, and Samueli are very philanthropic. They're, they're very into both the Anaheim Ducks and the San Diego Goals communities. They donate money to, to children's hospitals, to local schools, to health and wellness, a lot of street hockey, and a lot of uh, so uh, eating right and living right. And so all the, the money that we raise in our in our teams go right into our communities. Amazing. So we've we've donated almost $800,000 to wow. San Diego wow. since we started here. Matt, thank you so much. I know Thanks we're all out of time. Us. We could yes. talk to you forever. Goals uh, girls, so go over. Thank, <laughs> thank you. you. Have a winning season. We can't wait to see. All right, thank you guys. We'll be right back.